Let's take a look at questions that relate to kinetics and equilibrium. Starting with question one, you're asked to compare entropy of the reactants to the entropy of the products. Well, if you take a look, you're starting with a solid and a gas, and you're going to a gas and a liquid. So the entropy is increasing when you go from a solid to a liquid to a gas. There is an increase in entropy. That's the amount of disorder. in the system, or in this case, in a reaction. So again, the entropy of the reactants then, it's asking you to compare it, so the entropy of the reactants is less than the entropy of the products. Let's move on. For question two, you have all this information above, and in this question it says, state the effect of the frequency of the gas molecule collisions when the movable piston is pushed farther downward. So by pushing the piston down, what's happening. You are decreasing the volume and you're increasing the pressure. And temperature remained constant. So, the effect of the frequency of the gas particle collisions is that they're increasing in frequency. For questions 3, uh, 4, and 5, we have the information here. Again, let's take a look. Question three, compare the rates of the forward and reverse reactions at equilibrium. This is just a fact. The forward and reverse reactions at equilibrium are, also, are always equal rates. That's what's equal at equilibrium. The rate of the forward is equal to the rate of the reverse. For question four, it says state how the equilibrium shifts when SO3 is removed from the system. When you remove something from the system, the equilibrium shifts towards the side where you're removing something. So the shift in this case is towards the right. And finally, in question five, potential energy diagram for the forward reaction is shown in the answer booklet. I copied and pasted. It's right here. And it says, on this diagram, draw a dashed line to show how the potential energy of the en uh, changes when the reaction occurs by a uh, catalyzed pathway. Well, what a uh, catalyst does, it will speed up the reaction and it will do it by lowering the activation energy and that's here. So it's right in the middle. So you would put a dotted line and just put it lower than the way it's drawn. This is the first set of questions from Kinetics and Equilibrium. Check out part two in another video.